I thank you because you're gonna do us good. I am just a vessel. You are, oh God, the Potter. As Jeremiah said, I am just in your presence, Lord, that you may use me according to your word. Lord, I refuse to speak of myself, and I declare I will speak of you, Lord, in your presence, Lord, even in the presence of your people. I thank you and I bless you. In Jesus' name, I do pray breathing and trusting. Yeah. If you believe that the Lord is here, say a better amen. amen. A better than that. Amen. presence of God and you are not aware that the Lord is there. Amen. So we are here and we know that the Lord is here and the devil is defeated. Amen. One thing about the devil is that he is always a defeated fellow. Buana as if he went. Today I wanted us to learn about best results through obedience to the word of God. Amen. So if you are writing somewhere in the light, Best results through the obedience to the word of God. Bona Yesu na sikiwe. Wapendwa, wacha ni wambia suku hii ya lewa wapamba. The Lord wants us to obey Him. Amen. Bona na sikiwe. And we have to talk together. We have to, I have to hear some amen. Because we are not here an amen, I will shout my amen that the devil may hear it. Bona na Yesu na sikiwe. Kwa hivyo, the best the soul, the soul, through obedience. Bwana asifiwe. Ukiangaria katika hii bibiria yote, everywhere the Lord is speaking to the church, He is demanding obedience to His word. Amen? He is demanding obedience to His voice. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. The voice of the Lord, when it is that us, when it speaks to us, He demands something to be born out of that voice of the Lord. Amen? It is not in order we be coming to church from Monday, from Sunday to Sunday the whole year. And the Lord has talked to us so many things, and yet He is waiting for us to obey. Bwana atusaidie. Amen. And on this week, the pastor has been with us, but then he is always with us from Monday to Saturday. <laughs> Amen. So what about our morning, how we could church from Monday to Saturday. So he is always here. And one, one, one morning, I don't know whether he was talking to us concerning faith. James 2. Open for us. James 2.18. We are going to start from there. And I got a very big revelation about faith. Amen. I was just stuck by this word. But I said, I am going to start from there. Amen. He was talking teaching us. Go to James chapter 2, verse 18. And I was challenging myself. Oh God, is that what you are speaking to me? Because it was all about faith. That sometimes when I read this word, kuna pahali wana ifikisha na si yederesh, lakini kaona I need to complete this word so that I may understand this word. But someone will say, you have faith and I have words. Show me your faith without words and I will show you my faith by my works. You believe that there is one God, you do well. Even, this was the, the most challenging point, even the demons believe and tremble. Can you see that there is an exclamation mark? You believe? Unamini ya kwaba mungu yupo? Mapepo ya naamini mpaka ya nadebeneka. You cannot see that word. Continue. But do you want to know, O oh foolish man, that faith without works is dead? Was not Abraham our father justified by our works when he offered Isaac, his only son, at the altar? Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Do you see that? Faith was working together with his 
works. Faith means works. They were working together. And by works, faith was made perfect. Buana asifiwe. That word challenged me so much. And I hope through the power of the Holy Spirit, it will also challenge you. Buana yesu asifiwe. Uh, I know, I believe in the Lord. I know and you know that you are born again. We know that we are going to heaven by faith. Amen. Amen. And now, James talking to us, and he said, Faith without work is dead. Na kama ni nani yosema ni ya kwamba hapo chini wakati ni lisoma ni kaona ya kwamba even the demons believe and they tremble. Amen. The kingdom of darkness believe there is God and they still tremble because they know that this God is the one who sent them to down. Who sent them down. Amen. So they believe in the Lord and they tremble. So I was asking myself, if the demons believe, they can have me with you. And we also believe. Amen? Amen? Amen. Amen. What will make the difference between us and demons? Amen. 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 The difference will be made when we put our faith into action. When we take our step, another step, what we have found in the word of God, we put some more effort. We go to another step and we do according to the word of God. Amen. Last time about the but one, we were speaking about it shall be according to the word of God. Amen. Amen. Buana as if you. The Bible says, very without action is dead. Amen. It is totally dead. But even you see, even if Jehovah, even, even if we say that we, we have your faith, we have faith. Unless it comes to the point of action, it will not be faith. It will be something else. Buana as if you. Now, Captain Buana saw my hidden and a skins I didn't know. Nikachuliza Yakwamba. Well, one day, uh, when we teach these kids, these kids we teach them and they do the KCPE. Buana Yesu as if you. And they do, they go to school, what to know a funsa, when I end up with a rasa, when I finish from Tihani, what to that of Janani. Now, Captain Buana Kua can find a home Tihani, what to that of Janani. Uh, the great infringements, they just tell these people follow the instructions. Amen? Yes. Follow the instructions. And somebody was saying, Mutu Moja Alisema ya kwamba, Kuna Mutihani Moja ilifanyo pahali funani, Wakambiwa ya kwamba, Ya kwamba, The instructions were, Don't do any question. Those, that was the instruction given by the paper. Don't do any question. So, there was one person, only one person, who led those instructions and obeyed those instructions. One is a civilian. When you are cutting it, you are not going to comfort that you have to do it. What you are not going to do and you are not going to do it. But when the results came, the rest they were doing. They were doing, they were doing, they were doing it. But the, 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 remember the examiner has said, don't do anything in this paper. Amen? You need to test to make it live. And you are doing for how what? To test. Do these people listen to my voice? Do these people listen to what we have instructed them to do? The same word is coming to us today. We have to listen to the voice of the Lord. Amen? We have to listen to what the Lord is speaking to us. And there is no good results. There is no good results until we obey the voice of the Lord. Amen. Another test can come. Unabia Papa. We can be told find the area of this circle. Amen. You know the formula. Bona asifiwe. And Unajua katika, nilikuwa na wazahiri 
kitabu katika kitabu katika hiyo kitabu katika mtihani wa KCPE wale wa mwe wameweza through unapata kwamba there are so many answers and the answers nyingi zake zinakuwa zimekaribia majibu ya kweli kwa hivyo hata katika Ukristo unaweza pata answer before upate answer you kama unanielewa you can reach the end before you reach the end amen so i am saying like this and i hope you are going to understand in the case of pd they usually even tell for example find the diameter find, find the area of this circle you can know find the area of the circle what do we do let me interrupt you to that we may be together maria what do we do have you reached there in your in your in your syllabus find the area of the circle what is the formula
saying he talks about a wedding that was somewhere on the sun of Galilee. I love this this chapter. I love this thing. On the third day, there was a wedding in Cana of Galilee, and the mother was Jesus. The mother of Jesus was there. Now both Jesus and his disciples were invited in a wedding, and when they left out of the wine, the mother Jesus, mother of Jesus, said to him, "They have no wine." Jesus said to her, "Woman." What does your concern have to do with me? My hour has not yet been, has, has not yet come. His mother said to the servant, this is my point. His mother said to the servants, Amen. You know the mother of Jesus, Arikua and Metebea Naiz. Amen? If there was somebody who had moved with Jesus, it is his mother. Was about Mama wa Yesu Ariza, Akame. Up to 12 years, that's why you find Jesus going to the temple. After that, he was still with Jesus because we understand the Baba and the Kua and the Zaydiana and the Baba Yaki Kazi and Seremana. So, but the Kua and the Kana, yes. Amen. And when I read this one, they give him more strength. But the mother of Jesus, he knew God. Child, we have to know who God is. Nirazima, what he had yet to be. Nirazima to tapu and move where to Nina. You to show a quarter, move where to another mammal. Amen. Is there anything that is hard for you? Jua, move where to Anaweza Kufana Maboyote, the Hakuna Kusuni Lake, Rinaweza Kusuni. Hakuna at a moment. Go, our pastor always tells us the devil has no power over our lives. Amen. And we see he has no power. Is that the Lord has allowed him to come to us? But he is powerless. Yes. Amen. Yes. Are we lacking? That is just a small portion of our test. But that is not the will of God. It is a test so that the Lord will take us to another level. One as if you will. But the mother of Jesus said. Now, who can you a woman? I need a woman. I do to be a woman. Mary, Jesus called him woman. Woman, my time is not yet. Amen. It's good to respect. Because she. Ari, 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 Amen. He was just a vessel to carry Jesus. As we are vessels to carry Jesus today. Amen. Amen. So the Bible says, the mother of Jesus told them, whatever they tell you to do, whatever he tells you to do, make sure you do. Touch me or be a sick we are there. Amen. 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 Chochote mungu anasema tufane, wacha tufane, then to go there. Amen. Kira mungu, I love the one because the one of God does not come from any human being. Amen. Amen. So you hate the one of God, you hate God himself. Sure. Amen. Amen. If you hate this one, you hate God. Amen. And you are not a lover of God. Amen. Amen. So the Bible says, the mother of Jesus, akawabia, mimi na mjua huyu mtoto. Kila apacho anasema ukifanya, kitafaumu. Bwana asipio. Hata asubuhi ya lewa, adihuri ya lewa. Nataka kukwapia hivi. Chochote Yesu, anakunooneze. Zahimu, kuna mambo. Haikosi, kuna mambo. Mungu anakuambia fara. Amen. Through the word of God. Kuna mambo unachua kwaba. The Lord is saying you do. As you are praying, you are praying, mungu ni kukuke. Then the Lord is saying, Do what I tell you, do what I tell you to do. That is what the Lord is saying. Do what I tell you to do for better results. Amen. Amen. Do what the Lord is saying this afternoon for better results in your life. Kila mtu agepeta ma agependa maisha yake akafanikiwe. Kila mtu agependa wakatebe mungu hapa 
kwa hapa lakini biblia inatuambia kwamba as we want to move with god we need to do whatever he is and when these people the bible says when these people did and wakumbuka kwamba hao watu walitoka kibagogumu kwa sababu walianza kuchota maji wakiweka kwa tamu amen na hivyo ni wasma I was getting a revelation. This is what it was smart because they had come for a wedding. Amen. Na kwa kama wale wasichana na kina mama hawatakali kukuza uchafu wakati wameingia katika sherehe. They want to sleep. See you. They want to sleep. They don't want to touch anything. Amen. When they come for a wedding. But now Jesus anawapatia kitu gumu ya kwamba mchanze hizi mitungi na manzi. Amen. Foolishly, according to the human understanding. Your mother will be the same as Baba. The spiritual things can only be spiritually desired. Amen. I know kuna watu wali sema, huu ni mfara wachana na ye, anatawabia na mga gani. How can we put water? And yet we know how to make the wine. Amen. Waka achana na ye. Lakini kuna wale wali ti. Waka weka hizo mitungi. Waka jaza manji. Na Biblia inasema ya kwamba that 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 the same Jesus told them now draw some some and give to the guests and the Bible says the wine was so sweet that the precious previous one Bona Yesu was with you the wine was so sweet until mwenye sherehe akauliza he who feel your ego mwenye kwa wapi kwa nini umeanza kutupatia mfinyo ule mbaya mnamalizia na mfinyo ule mzuri Whatever Jesus does, it is not like a human being. Amen. Whatever Yesu anafanya, he hafani kitu inalikana na ya wanadamu. Hairikani na yetu. Hairikani na ya binadamu. Hairikani na ya wakuhu wa dunia. You can be given something good. But whatever God gives, whatever the Lord Jesus will give us, it is the best. Amen. But he needs our participation. Amen. He needs our participation. God cannot do his work alone. Amen. Hawezi kufanya kazi peke yake. Hawezi fanya mujiza study on himself alone. There must be a joining up of faith. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Mungu Mungu mwenzako anamwambia, ni lazima kuwe na pati na shida katika imani. Partnership. Amen. Amen. There must be partnership. You have to believe in God. You have to believe that He is there. Although the Bible says even the demons believe, but you have to go to another extent of doing whatever He tells you to do. Amen. Did you know that God will rescue you from the fire? Amen. Did you know that? Bwana asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe. Unajua wakati huyu mtu ambaye anaitwa Yona alisikia sauti ya Bwana ikimwambia, "Enda Enda wapi? Ni nene." Amen. To preach the gospel that these people may be saved. Then this person known as Jonah, he went to his own on his own direction. Did you know in the book of Yona hakuna sauti ingine Mungu aliongea mpaka wakati Yona aliamua ataenda Amen Hata wakati alikuwa anataka katika tubo la samaki Amen Mungu haongei until we respect the first word that the Lord has spoken Amen Until we obey that word, that is when the Lord so we must we must make this a lot of time to get the move on the enemy. That's how we are going to share the common sense. It is just like a child. We are being taught to walk. Either we will take a match, have a nice day, we will take a good one, and go for a new one. So, so, I love a good job. I just want to be a man with two methods. Man with two methods. I think I feel a sad. Amen. Amen. Sitapiga saa kwa sababu nimemtuma mara ya kwanza hajaenda. Anataka nitume lingine na namna gani? Siwezi. 
kwanza atili la kwanza bwana yesu asifiwe so best results we get when we are walking through obedience to the word of god amen i pray that the holy spirit of god may convince us enough that we may know what is the will of god and not knowing but also moving in the perfect will of god Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Whatever we receive that is not in the will of God, it will not be the best results. Amen. Amen. When Abraham went with Hajj, alifurahi kwenda na Hajj, lakini wakati Ishmael alipatikana. The Bible says, when Isaac came 15 years after Ismail Isaac alizaliwa miaka 15 baada ya Ishmael kuzaliwa. So when Isaac was born, Ishmael was a big boy. Can you imagine 15 years? 15 is a big boy, almost 18 years. So the Bible says because it was not as per the results of the word of God. Ishmael was not per the results of the word of God. Sometimes we settle at Ishmael. Amen. Amen. Tunapata Ishmael na tuna seto tunashangilia mujiza umekuja mujiza mkubwa ndio huu ninafurahia ninafurahia then all of a sudden it is not a miracle because it was not by the will of god how i pray that the lord may help us to understand what is the will of god amen amen so when ismail was born then later isaac was born the bible says He was told to set Ishmael away. Amen. Abraham had to set Ishmael away. Na unachoa ni damu yake. Kwa hivyo ilimuuma sana. Amen. Can you imagine to get your atume mwana wake abari na yeye hataki kuonekana katika hiyo nyumba. Na the Lord is telling me Ishmael hata lini ufame hata lini ni Isaac atakulini. Bwana asifiwe. So Abraham had settled before he settled. Amen. Then he had to send Ishmael away. Bwana asifiwe. He had to send him away. So the results of Ishmael they were not the perfect results of God. Amen. Yaani matokeo Ishmael haikuwa ndio matokeo ya Mungu. Lakini matokeo ya Mungu ilikuwa kwamba Abraham akavumilie, akavumilie na ndio maana Yesu anatuambia siku ya leo tuvumilie, tuvumilie kuna mateso, kuna dhiki wakati kama huu kuna mambo mengi yanaendelea ambayo yanatutisha, kuna mambo yanaendelea ambayo yanatuvunja moyo, hatuwezi toka katika haya mambo yako na yatakuwepo hata kesho na siku ndagani hata mwaka ujao yako, lakini Biblia inataka ya kwamba tukavumilie Amen. Tukavumilie. Amen. We be patient. Patient in the, in the presence of God. Kama kuna kitu umetarajia Mungu na bado hakijakuja, uvumilie ndani ya Bwana. Usibaduke hapo. Ni kwa nini usibaduke? Biblia inatuambia kwamba faith without action is dead. You cannot come out of the way and yet you believe in the Lord and you know that the Lord is coming to do what he said he will do unless we don't believe in the name of the Lord unless we don't believe in the word of God that is only time we can get out of the lane. Amen. We can get out of the lane that is an, uh, an implication that we don't believe in God. Amen. Can you imagine if there can be two one nikawa nakupeleka vibaya mwambie wewe aenda peke yako amen uende na mtu hivi uone anakutupa mwambie mimi ni njia siendi nayo upitie njia yako hivyo ndivyo ilivyo siku ya leo katika kanisa la Kristo amen wanasema wanaamini Mungu in the body of Christ wanasema tunakuamini Mungu unapelekana na yeye 
Munaenda, munakutangia ni Rai 45. Munaletea vika. Unasema Mungu, mimi huku pia usio huku ulikuwa unataka unipeleke. Mimi narudi 44 in Rai 44. Amen. So you are making God a confused. A confused God. Amen. Unamfanya Mungu ambaye ni Mungu ambaye hana mpango. Amekupoteza. And yeah, that's what the Bible says here, Baba. Even demons believe. But the demons cannot follow Jesus. Amen. Demons believe. But they cannot follow the word of God. When they hear the word of God, have a time. Amen. So it is a hard time. Can you sell a Christ? To do a Baba. Matokeo mazuri. Yanapatikana na kumiti neno la kwa. Amen. Amen. It doesn't matter when others have got results. Amen. Amen. Haijalishi. Kama wengine wamepata matokeo yao, hiyo sio shughuli zetu. Shughuli zetu ni kwamba we follow Christ. Amen. Amen. Where he goes, we go. It is a thing is not so good. Abraham was told. Aliambia mtu achague pahali atataka, yeye afuate njia za Mungu. Amen. Now what about the about the soma he had did it in the Bible? Abraham was blessed beyond blessings. Amen. When he went there, I go and say, Romeka, how can I go to such a place? And yet, I'm the one who God spoke to me. He did not speak to no root, Lord. And yet, I've been given a bad thing, a bad area. But Abraham knew he has gone with the Lord. Amen. Akuna kitu kibaya. Amen. At you put a sheet of seven, Mimi Kwanzia, Stakima Boya Mungu, was about in a pity among my mama Zito, Mambo, Mabayo, Hayani Pedes. You better stay there because you know the Lord has the best results. Amen. One day, a woman came to Elisha in the book of Kings. The Bible says this woman came to Elisha and told Elisha. Kaja kwamba mimi na wana wangu tunataka kutekwa nyanya kwa sababu tuko na madeni. Amen. Amen. Tuna madeni mengi lakini Elisha akamuuliza, "What do you have?" Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. What do you have? Amen. Amen. I'm also asking this question this morning, this, this afternoon on behalf of God. What do you have? That you can present to the Lord that you believe in Him. Amen. In other even in paraphrase, in a manisha, what are you doing that you can present to the Lord? Mukwam kama Ezekiel, Ezekiel. Akasema mimi na agaria ukuta, agaria kitu moja, abaya ni mepanya. Kwa sababu imani yangu aita ku imani kila kusema. Imani yangu mepwa ni imani na ni mepwa tiri na kutenda. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. So Elisha asked this woman, what do you have? Like, can you imagine this woman was very desperate. And I could be on a one. But I thought you have an attack on your body. And yet, the man of God there asked that woman, what do you have? I was coming to my senses, and I got to live there, Baba. I get cool, ni mama was sick of his. Come me. Nige, chukia Elisha sana. Maybe. Kwa sababu nige jiuliza, niko na shida, na yeye ananyogesha shida yungi. Labda nige mtu. Lakini niko, sababu niko na tarazia kwa ba, nilepo enda kwa mtumishi wa mungu Elisha, ya kwa ba, watoto haku wananyaguliwa, ya kwa ba, mimi sina kitu na kwa naku wamekufa, na alikuwa na madeni. Elisha atasema, enda, umijioga nae, that was the expectation of that woman. As it is the expectation of so many Christians today. They don't act to do things. They want physical things. Amen. But I am what do you have? Who can I need evidence? What do you have as an evidence? Amen. So this woman, akasema ya kwamba, mimi ni kuna kumafuta kidogo sana, alizaka ukile ya konacho. 
wapendwa usipata kama wengine watachidharau unajua kuna watu wamejaa na madharau dunia hii amen kuna watu wamejaa na madharau they dharau watu wa Mungu na hiyo roho tunataka kuitemea katika jina la Yesu amen we destroy it in the name of Jesus kwa sababu unapodharauliwa na wewe ujidharau hautafika kile kiwango ambacho Mungu ametuwekea ufiki amen the spirit of intimidation it is a spirit of intimidation amen you are brought down to zero maybe na wale watu mnakaa na wao wanakwambia hata wewe haujaokoka amen wanakwambia you know who was the son the, the, the son but and tobias said ya kwamba hata huu ukuta hata bweha akatembelea juu ataagusha huu ukuta that is a spirit of intimidation like it don't what you want to intimidate like it don't have need to be intimidated to be brought low usikubalishe mtu yeyote aingilie moyo wako akuleta chini amen haijalishi ni mambo gani unapitia Amen. Be proud of the things that you go through. Amen. Amen. Be proud of them. Amen. Amen. Be proud of what you have. Bona asifiwe. This woman was so proud with that small small and it some goes to God that little oil. Amen. Viva mia pia Elisha extends some little oil I have. Then when it I I had I tabui lakini the same oil Elisha was to Elisha told this woman Boro jazz uobe mitungi as much as you can can you see it is according to our faith amen it is according to our faith that you go and borrow the mitungi as much as you can kwa hiyo huo mwanamke huyu mama anaenda kigonga gonga mimi nini Unajua ndio alikuwa na madeni hata kiboga wanafikiri anaomba tena. Mm. Huyu alikuwa amedharauliwa vya kutosha. Lakini hiyo haikuzuia kwenda from hapo to the house house evangelist. Anagonga boga nipatie mtungi. Anagonga boga nipatie mtungi. Mpaka wakati mtungi yote ilipokuja, Elisha amwambia, "Funga mlango ukaweze sasa kumwaga hiyo mafuta kwa hiyo mtungi." Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Something that was foolish. Amen. 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 Kanisa usitake kupendwa na dunia. Acha nikwambie ukweli. Don't want to be loved by the world because the things of the world the things of God they are foolish. Amen. Amen. Mambo ya Mungu ni ujinga mkubwa kulingana na standards za dunia. Amen. Amen. Acha nenda church. Kwa ni wewe mjinga kiasi gani? Amen. 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 Unatoka baki kwani wewe ujiele mambo ya Mungu ni foolishness to them that does not believe amen amen huyo mama kaenda akiwaomba mitungi akasuka akaanza something i like about this woman about about this issue the whole issue alikuja akaanza kumwaga mafuta kumwaga mafuta do you know the bible said wakati alichukua mtungi ya mwisho akamwaga mafuta understand this wale wamelala wanuke kama kuna mtu amelala katika ni katika nyumba ya bwana mwambie it is very 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 precious alipo mwaga mtungi ya mwisho the bible says mafuta iliisha amen mafuta yakaisha what what does that one speaks to you how does it speaks to you inapoongelesha namna gani wakati anamwaga anamwaga lakini ile mitungi alikuwa ameboro wakati iliisha mafuta the all seeds what does that one mean it is going to be according to our faith amen amen yes. the faith of this woman maybe it was 20 gallons or 20 mitungi ishi amen, amen. what if she had more faith Jesus 
wakati iko katika process ya kufanya matendo that is when we meet our Lord Jesus Christ kwa hivyo bibi anasema kwa kwa kazi ya nyota ya mwisho ikasisi amen so it was according to her faith in other words it was according to what she can do amen god cannot bless us beyond our faith amen kwa sababu nyingine ingewekwa wapi the anointing the anointing of god cannot be poured on a on a, on a, on, a, on a service amen bona asifiwe when the lord comes with his anointing when the lord comes with his blessings he was a vessel that is ready by faith amen when the lord comes for his visitation amen he was a vessel that is ready because the lord cannot pour his anointing on a service amen kachumana kila wakati tunapokuja katika nyumba ya bwana na tunabudu mungu kuwa tayari kabudu mungu amen release yourself to the lord so that the lord may have a place in our lives amen do you believe in the lord then release yourself to this god that he may have a place he may take over he may have his own way not our own way so our faith must have something you have faith let me say in james let's go back to james as we finish let's go back to james amen bona asifiwe it's good to have faith in god but it is more important to do according to the faith that we have in the Lord. Bwana asifiwe. Kwa sababu Yakobo anatuambia ya kwamba si for example you have faith here. You have faith here. It is very smart. Can you see this faith? It is very smart. Very smart. And it can move mountains. Amen. Amen. It can move mountains. My faith can move mountains. It is very smart. Smart faith. Amen. James 2:18 Then here you have a it looks ugly because it is black. Amen. It looks very ugly. But they are the deeds I have done or you have done. Amen. Huyu mtu akiwa na hiyo imani yake na hiyo kushinda akisema nimeamini haitafanya kitu chochote. Amen. It will do totally nothing. Na kama kuna kitu utasahau, usisahau hii imani pasipo matendo ya imani haitafanya kitu chochote na hiyo ndio imefanya wahubiri wengi watanganye watu amen that's why many people have gone for shortcuts amen because they have been told you just do something small it will be okay but the word of god is talking to us that we obey the word of god so wanafuata ya kwamba kuombea neno la mungu ni very hard so they go to jia mbada ndio msoni ese Jia mbada but the bible will still remain good it will still remain established for the bible says the word of god is established in heaven so even when you go to heaven tutapata neno la bwana ndio 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 carpet amen amen the word of god is the carpet amen ya kwamba everything must start in that word of god amen but someone will say you have faith and i have one show me your life faith without your words faith without words is not good amen imani bila matendo haifai kamwe amen i was telling another person morning at over you cannot tell somebody pole 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 and then you are doing nothing about that pole amen this is a disease with so many christians i'm sorry to say and i should not say right now it's a very big disease amen amen, amen. and we will praise you we will shout before you lord we will jump because that it is good i am the biggest jumper in the house of the lord and i like jumping amen and i will not stop because it is good i'm the greatest worshiper and i will i like worshiping and i will not stop but after worshiping after praising god what do i do after that amen 
I shall say this in my preaching. After that, after saying, Mungu ni nakupenda, Mungu ni nakuinua, Oh, ni nakuinua, ni akia kawa ya bawa meolewa, ni wako atita akuja yako ama atita kikwabia, ni nakupenda wewe, kika hizi chambu ni nakupenda, shita hako, ame, ame, na wele after that, what are you doing after that? Eh? What are you doing after that? You say you love the Lord, and you cry in the tears. Yes, Lord, I love you. How I love you. Every hour. My one deepness. My righteousness. Oh, Lord, how I love you. Lord, I need you. Lord, I need you. Every hour. I need you. My one defense, my righteousness, oh Lord, how I need you. After singing, after crying for the Lord, what do you do after that? Amen. The Bible says, the Lord is watching over his word to be performed. By who? By me and you. Amen. By me and you. As you have said, I love you. I love you Lord more than everything else. Amen. I adore you more than everything else. When you go out of that service, that what you say means I mean, what you do, does it mean what you say? Amen. Amen. Faith without action.